just your average day on the military base yeah it, you can tell it's a little bit in disrepair but i mean as you can see we're pumping freedom in these big jugs from these pumps over here and uh, high commands like this is a very important location you must defend it at all costs if you lose it you better retake it before the boss gets back so you know nothing to see here just us hanging out next to our high-powered humvees oh god what do you know it's a freaking ambush so the red boys are moving in but if you look at this compound we've got this moat we've also got like this heavy big jet and a few other support vehicles inside, but it looks like the enemy is massing in force. I kind of worry, because if they do take it... Ooh, nice shooting. Thanks, me. You're welcome, you. What? Oh, man. Well, the first one was nice. All right, I'm going to flank around. Yeah, we're clearly in the desert somewhere, which does explain the freedom juice, a.k.a. oil. Oh, God. This was a bad idea, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I was sniped by that guy. But needless to say, this base is getting overrun. But don't worry. I have a really, really good idea for how we can take it back. I think I want to respawn at the hangar. Because the enemy forces are already inside the base. We've got a bunch of disabled vehicles here. Like M1 Abrams. We got, And all we were given is this machine gun jeep and this four-wheeler. Oh god, is that a grenade? <laughs> he stands and looks at it, hoping it won't explode. Now, these are really, really good oh, defenses hi, here. So hopefully the enemy won't get... Oh, man. This must be a decommissioned base. But I'm working for some, like, private company. Private military company. Oh, where did you guys come from? Where the other guy came from? How am I still alive? It's in moments like these... When you die. Guys, we must defend the hangar. They're moving in from the other side. I swear, this map is like something I may have played on like one of the old Battlefield games. Back when, you know, they were good. Yeah, so the enemy crept through there. Yeah, this is a sprawling compound, but unfortunately for us, we were only given a handful of men. And look at how big this base is. I don't know how we're supposed to be able to defend it all. There's way too many points of vulnerability here. Oh my God. Do I have meds? Okay, well, let's drop the meds. I'm gonna try to guard this door. It's it's literally just me. Oh god. Oh, this is bad. Uh, I kind of. Uh, I'm running out of ammunition. I have to reload. They just keep funneling through here. But this is definitely a good spot. Somehow the smoke grenades are working towards me. Oh look at this! I've been playing Escape from Tarkov. Check it out, boy. We got that lean. What if there was a raven? Oh. Ravenfield of Tarkov. So I've taken down five people just from this little corridor alone. But eventually the gas is going to wear off, or rather the smoke, and I don't have any reinforcements for it. Be like, what if- Oh! No! Oh gosh, I'm going to get executed here. Please don't shoot me! Please don't shoot me! Please don't shoot me! He, he shot me. Oh my god, they're all moving in. I'm going to take a squad with me this time. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Friend, friendly fire is great. Oh my gosh, it's a freaking ambush. They're on all sides. I need 60 round magazines. That's what I need. They're trying to flank over here now. Can I jump? No, I cannot jump through there. I have to go out the back of the hangar. Oh, biscuits. I looked the wrong way. So if we look at the map, it looks like we lost the gate. I mean, you can kind of tell we've lost the gate by the amount of people that are creeping around on all sides. Uh-oh. This was a bad idea. Whoa! I found a sneaky little spot, though. I don't think they'll be able to see me too well over here. Uh-oh. They're bringing a heavy machine gun jeep in. I should be able to ambush it if it comes this way, though. Can you see it? I see... Oh, it's outside of the gate. Hmm. Oh. All right, against my better judgment, we're moving over here. I gotta hit the Jeep, that's my job. My job is the Jeep. I can't see it. I hear it. Let's try this. <laughs> All right, keep holding the walls. Oh, I see the Jeep. It's out there on the hill. If I could take that out, I could buy us some precious time. All right, I'm going slow motion. Come on. Oh, I've overshot it. 
That's not good. All right. We turn into the matrix here. Overshot. What is going on? I think I'm moving in the middle of shooting and that's the issue here. All right. Don't move. Don't get shot. Blasted it. Okay, good. I bought us some precious time. We're going to have to retreat into the base. The fortress is getting overrun. Oh man. You guys are doing a great job holding this corner. Look at this. Uh-oh. This isn't as well defended as I thought it would be. But can I use these ladders? Oh man. I, I forgot that I had forgotten how to use ladders. Blah! Oh man. Guys with shotguns. This is not good, man. They're moving in. They are going to take the base. Well, the enemy's taking the base, but I've got a plan. First thing I need is a few good men. So as our infantry start to skirmish, we are gonna take to the skies. Boys, hop on board. Oh, we got the medical version, but it looks like we can carry two men on either side, plus myself and my co-pilot. So the idea here is to fly into this base and land at vulnerable parts where the enemy is probably not gonna be defending. Like over here near this runway, I think, oh, okay. Uh, I just lost all my boys. We're gonna have to go back to base. Uh, could we repair this thing maybe? Oh, oh God, buddy, it's on fire. Well, I mean, we could always use the armed variant. Look at this thing. I could use a co-pilot, but I might not need it. <laughs> oh yes. Oh my goodness. We've taken that flag. Now, as long as I just don't get slam rounded. Oh, I mean, speak of the devil, man. All right, you guys, you guys want to use rockets? I got rockets. Oh my God. These things are amazing. Okay, this is probably the coolest helicopter I've ever played. Now, what we need is like a bigger map of this. Ooh, hello, boys. These things actually feel like rockets. Hello, fellas. <laughs> I see you guys hiding behind that rock. Be a shame if uh, we had air support. Remember, I, like I said, this freedom juice, this oil is worth a lot of money. We got to get it back. So once we lost the base, it was really easy to ask for reinforcements by way of vehicles. Oh man, I could land a sniper like right up here. If I could land this thing without dying. <laughs> We're moving in on the final base. Is there anybody back here defending this flag point? No, there's not. Let's get the MH6. This is the transport variant. It's still quick and nimble. We've got to land this one time, right? I mean, oh, shoot. Ooh. Hey, there we go. Guys. All right, everybody on board. Bye, have a great time. We've got to do a little bit of a scouting mission here. Look at this, that moat. Yeah, if they would have expanded this and had more spawn points and had this base under siege, that's what I would love to see. I want to paratroop drop, paratroop drop my boys on a not as defended area to see if an aerial invasion can't work. So what we do is we'd go high altitude. We got to slow it down so I can give orders. Dang it. How? They really going to make me do this. Everybody on board. We're going to do this. I swear it's going to happen. We are going to make it happen. Nobody's protecting this one. Now it's not very well defended. All right, we're going to get some altitude. Well, I can't give any orders. Hmm. We're going to have to do this the old fashioned way. Dive, dive, dive. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. Whoa. I swear I went to piloting school, guys. Yeah. Ouch. <laughs> All right, boys, let's do this. Let's take this flag. Enemy troops are over there. Oh, God. Take this flag, boys. Aerial invasion. Across the moat. Oh gosh, we're losing men fast. Look at how brave they are. Yeah. All right, well, we did take it, but now they're moving in. Did you just see the Jeep's glass break? 
Are you kidding me? Well, it, it does show that we can use an aerial invasion and take over this base, which is absolutely beautiful. I would just love to see this map fleshed out. Maybe I should make something like this. Anyway, if you guys do want to see more Ravenfield, pull the trigger on that like button to let me know, and I will see you in the next one.